Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So um, today, before we move on, I just want to address the elephant in the room. Yes, I had my braids done and you will be surprised to know that I did this myself. Yeah, yeah so it was, a, it was heavy, it was a roller coaster, but you know, I managed to get it done. It's been in for a week now, um, it's doing okay. I literally, this was literally the first time I've ever done braids and the first time I've ever done anything like this up to my hair and I'm really stoked to the way it came out. Anyway, so um, before we move on, I just want to, I just want to find out if you guys are subscribed to my channel yet. Are you? Well, if you aren't, please make sure to subscribe, like, comment and let me know what you guys think of this video. So without further ado, let's get okay. started. So today I'm going to be doing a first impressions or a, basically a review of the Pink Cosmetics brand, which is a local brand in South Africa. And I am so excited because I love supporting local and I love when we have such amazing products that, that we can find so easily and it's affordable i mean i really like brands that i can afford because i am a bit of a cheapskate <coughs> so um yeah i ordered this box from pink cosmetics so this is their october influencer box and I, it's so so pretty i mean like look at this box man um anyway so inside the box and I, I opened this already like I'm just saying I, I didn't I didn't try out the box I didn't try out anything in the box yet because like I really wanted to be I really wanted this video to be an actual first impressions but I mean I know how it looks and yeah so I tried to keep it as first impressions as possible so basically this is what the box looks like inside out oh, it looks ugly but it comes in this pretty little paper and it has this little unicorn that says the pink collection and i think it's so so pretty and then inside the box you get like a few goodies which i like yeah i mean anyway so the first thing that i've noticed in the box which i really love is these unicorn teardrops so it says unicorn teardrops over here and um these are basically bath bombs and the ingredients are really like it's body safe and um, it contains it may contain oats, milk and polysorbate so definitely let you know if there's anything that you might be allergic to so um, yeah these smell so so amazing like I think they are so cute like I'm not sure how exactly I'm going to use them like if I should throw the whole thing in the bath but to be honest I still have like a bath bomb from Lush that I got like a year ago and I haven't used it it still smells amazing though but anyway so these are the unicorn teardrops and they are so 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 cute okay the next thing that we got was a face mask why am I saying face a face mask powder um this is really the first time that i've seen something like this like i really don't know how it works and i'm so so interested in knowing how it works like if you know me and if you do follow me on instagram which you should by the way um these i normally do diy face masks and i have like a whole lot of diy face masks on my account which you can check out and which you can try out for yourself so i'm not really into buying face masks myself because I, i'm really natural and i really love natural products but looking at this so it says that it's a cocoa or cacao ginger and turmeric moss which is amazing turmeric for me is like i love turmeric and i i literally love using turmeric as in my face masks which is so great which is so great and like literally what i want and um so it's a nourishing skin food for a smoother softer and brighter skin which is like always what i'm looking for i like my skin to be brighter especially for the dark circles that i have under my eyes and um i have some pigmentation as well in my skin so this is really really nice for that and um part of the ingredients is bentonite clay which i know is such a good good ingredient such a good raw ingredient to add into your face mask as well so I'm really like 
this is really nice um it has raw cacao it has bit of vitamin c whoa it has activated bamboo com carbon which is also so great vanilla lavender flower marshmallow root cinnamon turmeric and ginger like are you for real like this is perfect so it smells almost like chocolate and vanilla but more vanilla than chocolate i mean it's so nice okay so basically you have to wet make this um, mask with one teaspoon of the face mask you add warm water, green tea, or warm milk to form a thick paste. I'll probably add warm milk because, like, the more the better. Um, and then you taste it. You taste they. You can taste it on your neck to see if there's anything that you might be allergic to. And um, you can apply a thin layer on your eyes, let it dry, and remove by gently massaging your face with a wet, warm washcloth to exfoliate the skin. <gasps> This is so nice, guys. Like, I'm so excited to try this out. Okay, so the next thing that we got, which, guys, I already opened this and it's so cute. This is the, um, the jelly soap bar. Like, who makes jelly soap bars? Like, come on, this is so cute. Um, and it comes in the shape of a unicorn. Okay, wait. Let me, let me, let me, let me represent this unicorn, you know, give him some dignity. So, this is what it looks like. Look at her. Okay. Now, I'll, I'll, I'll show you guys in a different way, but this is so cute. Like, what? And there's like glitter all over. It's so, 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 so pretty. So flippin' pretty. Um... Yeah, the like how do I I don't know. <gasps> it has eco glitter. Like what? Pink cosmetics. <laughs> Y'all are doing the things. So, um if you don't know, I am a conservationist in profession. Yes. And um I am very, very passionate about the environment and I will do and I'll and I will do whatever it takes to like obviously minimize my my carbon footprint um I know it's not easy to me it's not easy at all especially with all the products that are out there that it looks so pretty but they don't have they're not eco-friendly they are cruel they aren't cruelty free and um that just makes it hard hard for me to actually really want to buy something without feeling really guilty about it so the fact that this is eco glitter in wow guys like this is amazing i am i'm so i'm so excited to use this like you can use it guilt free <laughs> okay so um yeah so basically to use the soap you have to break off a small piece i was thinking of how i'm going to use the soap because i don't want to use the whole thing on my body and then you know kind of make the destroy the unicorn Anyway, break with a small piece and lather it on a washcloth or loofah with chili soap and lather up. Clean skin and rinse with warm water. So these handmade soaps are like washing with chili, all wiggly and wobbly. This is so... <laughs> but I really don't want to break the unicorn. I really don't want to. But yeah, I'm excited about this one. Um. Okay, so the next thing that I got... Um, was these pink lip lusters so um this is basically just um, some okay. sample so these are the lip the lip lusters they are really really pretty pretty small but sample size um so pretty and this one is called tiger lily so it's almost like a copper copper kind of color and um this one is called peony blush so this is more like obviously a pink like a peony pink um these are so so pretty i will swatch them for you guys and let you know how it go comes out but basically these you can either use as a lip gloss or you can use it over like maybe a 
math look. Hmm, maybe I should try it out for you guys. Let, let's see. Oh. Smells so liquor. Like, what the hell? I want to eat it. Mm -hmm. Look how pretty. Look how pretty this looks. Guys. <laughs> so pretty. Okay. Oh, I just want to show you guys up close. If I can. Look how. <laughs> I mean... This just took my look to a whole new level. Like, <sighs> and it smells so nice. <laughs> I like it. Okay, so yeah. Um, the last thing that I got, which is from Flamingo Moon, is this little. Uh, metal case thing um, and I really like this like the reason why I like it is because I know I, I know I'm always losing some more things and I can put like bobby pins um, lashes in it guys I lose lashes like nothing like it's weird I can't so I don't wear lashes anymore because whenever I buy a pair, like I'm always losing one, always. So this is what it looks like. It's so cute. It's so cute, and oh, I think I think there's something inside. I don't know. Let's open it up. Oh, two little sweeties. Yeah. Oh, and sherbet sweets. I love sherbet. So, um, yeah, basically that's all that I got in the box, and I am so happy with it. Um, inside I also got a few pamphlets, and this, like, speaks to my heart. It says, ever wondered how you can change the world? It's simple. Just say no to plastic. Guys. Pink cosmetics, you all, um, yeah. Thank you, like honestly, thank you for for making these really amazing products that are eco-friendly, biodegradable, um, vegan. It's just wow. Okay, so I got a little lift from them, and it's basically just telling me more about the products. So it says unicorns glitter, makeup, and all things pink. To be honest, I love pink, and I love glitter, and I love unicorns. Like. So, um, they were basically launched in 2014 and they were made in the beautiful mother city. So, it's easy to see why nature is the main inspiration behind pink. Definitely, like, we have such, such beautiful biodiversity in the mother city and, yeah, like this, oh my word. Okay, so, basically, functionality is number one, but it doesn't hurt to add some sparkle to your day. Ugh, guys. <sighs> Okay, so this this um their ranges are basically inspired by the dewy, glowy, and minimalistic makeup look, which is also something that I love. I don't wear a lot of makeup. Um, I love looking dewy. I love looking minimalist. Like that is just my thing. So um, so it's all about understated elegance and letting your natural beauty shine through. Like yes, natural beauty. Um, so. But the products are designed to mix together to create your own signature colors and work effortlessly together. Like, this is my, my signature color, guys. Um, then the other thing it says is, let's celebrate realistic, imperfect beauty 
with easy to use products that aim to make you feel comfortable in your skin and reflecting your personal style. Okay, so these are the products are, are produced with the highest quality ingredients and integrity. So there's no parabens, sulfates, or petrochemicals. They don't taste on animals, and they and um, they are all vegan. Yay! Like wow. So Janet, who is I'm assuming is the owner of the company, and she reached. She actually emailed me. Just to say thank you for ordering my box, which I thought was so, so cute. Um, so her mission basically is to educate customers about what they are using on their skin. And she says, I want to educate others about the dangers of harmful ingredients that cause damage to the skin. I want them to feel empowered and to know that there are safe and superior options available. And Pink Cosmetics op epitomizes this truth so wonderfully. Girl, like, this is so, so, so true. So, yeah, um, I am, honestly, I'm honestly shook, like, I'm very, I'm so, I'm so, like, happy that we actually get a brand that really cares about the environment, like, it's so, so difficult to find a product that that showcases this passion, you know, for the environment and for basically on serving our environment, especially in the country that we're in, in our beautiful biodiverse country. And guys, sorry, but this is clearly, clearly my passion. And um, I don't know, like, I'm so happy that I actually ordered this. I'm so happy that I actually came across this company. This is such, such amazing messages that they are bringing across. And the products are great. Like. Like really. Why have you not checked out Pink Cosmetics yet? Go right now and order you something. And just order it guilt free guys. Guilt free. And just celebrate life. Celebrate your imperfect beauty. And yeah like i love the message that they are bringing across so thank you guys for watching i am so happy um with this video like i didn't expect to be so happy about it honestly but it's i'm really impressed and um this was such a great experience and these are such such beautiful products and i can't wait to try these out um if you want to know more about the products i will be posting more reviews and more like of my experience on my instagram so please follow me on my instagram and check it out and yeah then maybe you can you know maybe you'll feel better about buying something from because they think this guys this is so great um another thing is um i am thinking of starting a series where i test out different local brands in South Africa similar to being cosmetics like hopefully if I can find more vegan more eco-friendly brands um, so if you guys know of any brands and you know you love them and you maybe are interested in trying these brands out let me know in the comment section down below and I will see what I can do for you guys so thank you guys and see you soon